hey guys welcome back to the channel i am at walmart and i am here to do some clearance shopping and to do my um easter dinner haul it is a gloomy wet day in florida so yeah i see you guys when i get inside guys today is the 28th and you see all this stuff right here because you know the first is monday Easter is Sunday. All of this stuff is going to be on clearance. I think they start at 50%. So, yeah. Not the pillows, but the candy, the baskets, the basket fillers, all of this. So, keep your eyes open and, you know, and just, you know, stuff you like to buy in advance or save it or, you know, candy. Because some of this candy be good for like six months to almost a year out. Oh. And so, yeah, if you wanna get you some, your kids some Easter baskets out the Easter, get those toys. So yeah, I just wanna let you guys know that. Yeah, I'm gonna get um, my baby some of this mouthwash. They are $4.97 and I came last week. They were completely out. And I see that, I think they have three left. I'm gonna pick up all three of those. This stuff works if they use this right and you coach them because i'm sorry at seven years old in my opinion you still need to be coached you know to floss and brush properly this stuff works so my son's been using this for about like a month maybe a month and a half because that other stuff like this wasn't getting it it was not cutting it and so I just went through the Walmart app and I read the reviews of this and I was like, yeah, and it does work. And it's anti-cavity because no matter how much you tell your kids to go brush their teeth after eating, you know, cleaning and stuff, their kids. So yeah, and those are $4.97 each. Guys, remember in my um, Family Dollar video when I told you the Aussie was $2.50 there and I thought it was an amazing deal? This that same Aussie, $4.97 at Walmart. I was looking for the Suave Kids Detangler Spray because that's what my baby used. Is that a one back there? Hold on, guys. They only had one. They had another product in front of it. And this is what I use every day on his hair to detangle it. And these are actually $4.97. I was hoping they had more. So what I'm going to have to do is go Saturday to Dollar General because they had like two in stock. Or I may even just have to go to Publix and just pay for it and see what they have because that is something that he used literally every single day. And I remember when that product was like two dollars and like ninety seven cents, two fifty. Now it's actually five dollars a bottle. It's four ninety seven. What's a few pennies? Off the tax, like five eighteen or something, five twenty. And see, this is where couponing come in handy. Because for the stuff that they don't have coupons for, because you've already coupon for the stuff they do, now you can save money. Because you have saved money, and now you have extra money to get things that you can't find coupons on for. I'm going to pick up this paddle brush. It is $184 for myself. Now look, they have them in two different places, say $6.97, which I don't mind, but I wanna know if it's $184 or $6.97. But they used to have another one that's a little wider than this, and it's about seven bucks. That's the one I have at home. I'm wanting to get another one. And guys, this is why having the app on your phone is, is really important, especially if you shop Walmart all the time. It's actually $184. So I'm gonna pick that up and see if that works. Guys, check your Walmarts if you're in, you know, the need of buying toys, whatever gifts. I'm gonna scan. Oh, they had a lot of stuff. Four dollars. Four dollars. Four dollars. And guys, just because you buy it now doesn't mean you have to give it to them now. You can save it for birthdays and Christmas. And you can always um, buy stuff like this to have it on hand for a surprise birthday party that comes up so I want to invite your kid to.
because I bought um, AJ over the last two months of I think about six or seven dinosaurs and I haven't given him not one of them yet. Um, he will be getting two of them in his Easter basket and he get one or two for his birthday in July and then the rest is going to be um, for Christmas. I do this all the time. You do not have to get something today and give it to them the same day. You can save it because you never know how funny your money may be in three months or two months now because you bought in advance. Your kid or grandkid, you know, that little one in your life has, you know, that gift. And if you don't have it, that's okay too. Because as I tell you guys all the time, every sale isn't your sale. Every deal isn't your deal. And guys, when you're in this store, always scan. Don't assume that the item is in the right place because sometimes people put items in the wrong place and a lot of times the associates put stuff right behind tags and they know it does not go there. And everyone does not have the same um, policy, you know, when it comes to um, shopping, for example, Publix. If the tag is not what it rings up and it rings up more, they'll give it to you free. And then the next one you get at that price of the tag. There's just so much that's on sale. Yellow tags. So pretty much guys, just check your stores. It is so much here. You know, and in this sales stuff like this, I'm sure it varies from store to store. So just check your store. I think I got him that one already. <laughs> I believe that. I am waiting for this one to go on sale. This is right here is $34.99. That is the one that I believe he does not have and I'm patiently waiting for that to go down. Guys, in store, this one is $34.99. But on March 19th, as you can see, I purchased it online for $21 and I got back $8. So the Walmart app, it's a good app to have. I got back $8. And as you can see, it says $34.97. That is the price I just scanned it for in store. I take it back. It's $32.88 right now in store. Sold online by Walmart in store. That's how much it is. And I got it on the 19th online for $21 and they gave me like $8. See right here on the 19th where it says $8 Walmart cash added and it's for buying that toy and I bought it at $21 not $32.88. So yeah even on a bottom if you go through your Abata app there's a section to say babies and toys they give you my money back for buying toys, guys. If you're gonna buy a toy anyway, if you know your kid is into dinosaurs, because they do give a lot of dinosaurs and Legos. And that's something that you're gonna buy anyway. Always check your app and see which ones that they included in a um I'll buy the rebate. Magnus price cut to $17.50, $57. Price cut $34.99. $36. They have some that's $5.50, $6.50. So, yeah, just check your stores, guys. If you're in the market, you know, buying toys, got a birthday or something, like I said, coming up, or you just like to buy stuff in advance and just have it. Clearance, five and under in this section. 
Clarence, seven and under. In this section, still seven and under. Clarence, ten and under. In this section. Clearance, 15 and under in this section. Clearance, 20 and under. In this section. Twenty five and under. They really don't have you know anything that's popping out to me. But guys, when you're buying clearance, you have to be mindful. <laughs> So not, you know, if you get it, immediately go home and check to make sure all the parts are there. Don't wait, you know, a month or two. And that's why when buying clearance, especially using it as a gift, sometimes it's hard because you can save it for a gift. And then you go back and it's like, um, the person get it and there's pieces missing. So that's one of the downfalls of buying something like in a box like this you don't know if anything is missing now, that's a cute little gift for the little jeweler in your life that likes making bracelets and things like that now that's nice gift. the ninja turtle with the bike and there's some mixed reviews about cocoa melon I'm not gonna get into that but I read reviews on this and our views online was not good about this. The bike doesn't stand up on its own or something. Mm. And that is my baby theme for his <laughs> Easter basket. No, no it's not. His theme is dinosaurs. That's what I'm talking about, see? Just trying to spend money to spend money. It's America. No, this is cute. But I don't know, do I want? It is a dino rock painting, three sand fossils, but do I want that in the house? I'm going to think about it. I think it's $14.97. Let me scan. If it's less than $14.97, I may get it. If it's not, I'm going to think about it because our, the sand, the cleanup behind it is going to be, yeah. Guys, do you still buy your kids Easter outfits or is that a thing of the past? I know when we were coming up, we had the... um. The Easter outfit and we got you know the suits or the dresses for Easter is that a thing of the past have we moved on um, from that guys right quick I want to show you something both of these shorts are 10 12 10 12 but this is a husky and this is a regular can you see how much more fabric is in these shorts let me see if I can get you a better view edged up right now come on to the side now they're both 10 12s the yellow is a 10 12 regular and these rose pink peach are twin 10 12 husky wow that is amazing it like a, a totally different size my baby wears a 10 12 husky but that husky looks huge I'm scared to buy the 10 12 regular but I may pick up these blue ones and just see how it you know fits because it's the thigh part that I worry about because it's thighs <laughs> but at the same time I don't want them so big and bulky you know on him <sighs> Okay guys, first thing I'm gonna pick up is a can of the cream and mushroom soup at 164. 
I'm gonna pick up a thing of the Great Value Ranch at $197. I'm gonna pick up a thing of the Craft Catalina Light at $248. I'm going to pick up some Great Value Sliced Olives at $197. No, I'm not. I'm going to get the Lindsay's one because they're 184 I'm going to grab two of these because my son likes these. I'm going to pick up a thing of the um, Great Value Elbow Noodles at $0.98. Cents. I'm going to pick up two of the Sunmade Yogurt Covered Raisins. They're $2.97. I'm going to pick up one of these Great Value Cocktail Peanuts at $4.94. I was looking for the small one, so what's going to happen for me? Once this is gone, I'm only going to buy this for this month. Because I really shouldn't be eating this anyway because of the sugar. Sugar. Might as well be sugar. The salt. So that's what it is. So once this is gone for the month, I'm not buying any more peanuts because I come in here and buy peanuts all the time. I probably buy like maybe three of the small ones and then I get two of these and that's in a month and that's just too much salt. And I actually use the peanuts sometimes as a meal replacement. I just take peanuts, um, those yogurt covered raisins and some pecans and I mix it up, make my own like little trail mix. And I do like a half of, of the like, little sandwich bag and that's sometimes a meal. But I also know that salt um, helps also retains water. So I'm not gonna try to be doing all that. Uh oh, the rain is coming down. And guys, when you're shopping, make sure you check your, um, your dates your items okay and then I'm gonna pick up some of these great value crackers and I always get the ones with no salt and I use those for a little um snack what I do is I take peanut butter peek up I, I put peanut butter on the crackers I do about 10 of them put peanut butter on them and then I take crushed um, pecans and I top them with that and then I drizzle them with a little honey and that's what I eat as a snack Sometimes I get the um, pretzels to go into my um, trail mix, but I'm not gonna do it this time because of the salt and the um, carbs is kind of high on those. I'm gonna skip that this month. Normally I used to um, eat the, put the Cheerios in there, the honey nuts, but I haven't had honey nut Cheerios in like over a month because that was my go-to, everything for breakfast, lunch, dinner, and I became like, I won't say addicted to it, but that's what I ate all the time. And if you read the servings and the carbs on there, in moderation, it's good. But I was like, nope, I'm not gonna replace one bad thing with another one. So no. Guys, my location here no longer carries the Airwick Fresh Matic. I've been looking on the Walmart app and I'm in store today and I don't see not one can. So it looks like I may have to go to the Glade. But I really don't want to. I'm gonna pick up a thing of Great Value Low Fat Sour Cream. I am gonna be using this in my um, macaroni and cheese. I got um, 18 count of eggs. Those are three or two. I wanted to get some um, of the Great Value Sweet Tea and uh, the orange juice, but it's raining. <laughs> you know what I mean? So yeah, th those items I can leave in the car. The eggs I can just carry up upstairs. Those can be left in the car. But so I'm gonna get uh, a block of this Great Value cream cheese. right here and I also use this in my um, homemade macaroni and cheese along with the sour cream and five different um, cheese and that was 184 a brick I'm gonna go ahead and pick it up of course you know it's 648 this is my son's favorite I bet these little items that I have in my car <laughs> I bet it's about 50 bucks I kid you not so yeah, I'm gonna um, pick it up because they're out of school tomorrow. I don't understand why they're out of school. We need to literally just went back from spring break. And I'm gonna grab one of these Great Value Sweet Teas. They're $2.98. The items in my car are items that we're completely out of, or almost out of. And so it, it's, you know, there's just random stuff that's like 
olives were completely out of that. The peanuts were completely out of that. Um, the eggs were completely out of the cream cheese, the orange juice, the sweet tea, the Catalina, the elbow noodles were out of it. The quinoa mushroom, out of it. We have a little bit of ranch, a little bit of sour cream, and two boxes of the um, raisins um, left. So this was just like a um, slash Easter because a lot of the stuff that I have already, like the cheese that we got, what, two months ago? Was it two months ago or a month ago, guys? From Publix, that Kobit, Kobot cheese, buy one, get one, the brick cheese. I redeem every dollar off my account. So I think we had like a digital and like a um, Publix um, green fly coupon also. So that's the cheese that we're gonna use in my macaroni. I saved that cheese. And so all I had to pick up was the elbow noodles, the cream cheese and the sour cream to go in that um, for my semi-homemade dressing. I'll be using the cornbread base from the um, Dolly Parton, remember? I think it was last month or the month before we got all that um, cornbread for little of nothing. I think I got like six boxes for $5 because we had those great digitals over at Publix. So I'm gonna use that as my cornbread base. I already got the chicken broth. And all I needed was the um, the puma mushrooms and the, um, the semi, which makes this semi homemade is the stove top. I put stove top dressing in my, the crumbles in my dressing and I got those from Dollar General when they had that food sale like last month. And then they were like 70 cents or a dollar a box. I think they were less than a dollar a box. I got those and I'll be using those. Yeah, so I'm gonna pick up some um, onions, bell peppers, and greens next. I'm going ahead and get my greens now, even though Easter is on Sunday, which is right around the corner. So tomorrow, while he's out of school, I'm just gonna get up and take care of the, the greens. And I prefer cutting up my greens versus the bags, because I found out when using the bags, I end up throwing away more, because if I see any spots or anything, you know, this color, this coloration, I throw them out. So I get the bundles. Guys, they are $2.48 a bundle. I did pick up two. I was debating whether or not to do one or two. Uh oh. I think I'm just gonna grab two. But I really wanna just grab one. <laughs> because I really, really, really don't want. I don't wanna cook them, but. I only like them when I cook them because I know the way that I clean my greens. And the way I clean my greens is, first thing I do is I leave the road bed on and I cut the stem off. The bottom stem. That part right there. I cut it off. Then I open them up and I take each leaf and I rinse the front and the back. And in this process, if there's any brown spots or any hard spots, I pull those off. I tear it off around. It looks like a bug may have been eating around it. I tear it off. Then I go back and I cut off the stem. Once I remove the stem, I cut my greens up. And I wash my greens three times in salt water vinegar. So I get in and I scrub them real good in the salt water vinegar and I let them sit. Then I take them out pour off that water in that bowl because I'm going to put them in another bowl because I don't put them in my sink. And then I take them out and I put them back in the clean bowl. Then I add more water, vinegar, and salt. And I shrub them again and I let them soak. And I do that a total of three times. And I use celery in my dressing, but this celery is not, is not given. Uh-uh. And what I picked up guys off camera was I picked up four sweet potatoes. They're supposed to be 98 cents each. I hope they're 98 cents each versus 98 cents a pound. <laughs> I picked the one bell pepper. I think it's like 78 or 84 cents. And I picked up two bunches of greens. I didn't get the celery because the only thing I actually use the celery for is the um, dressing. And I'm not doing a um, turkey because I normally we'll put it in the side of the turkey what I have left so so I'll use like maybe a, a one stick out of there and the rest of it is like what I do with it so no I didn't get it 
this is my total without the clothes added. This is just for all the food, 50 bucks. Y'all, $34.97 for the two shirts, the brush, the three things of mouth wash, and the spray. Stay focused. Okay guys, that was a successful trip. Everything wrong up what it's supposed to. I got what I needed to complete our um, Easter dinner. Um, I've got everything to complete his Easter basket, that dinosaur shirt that I picked up from him for 4 dollars is gonna complete his Easter basket. I'm done buying items for that. And yeah. Oh, guys, I'm gonna be honest, guess what? I forgot to go into the women's clearance section. That was one of the reasons why I wanted to come because I wanted to see if they had any dresses that were on sale. And I completely forgot, and I think it's because it's raining and I bought more. I bought what I was supposed to buy. That's what I had on my list. But when I got here, it was raining. I was like, well, any items that have to be brought up <laughs> like cold items I wasn't gonna get I was gonna come back and get them but even so I was like no I don't feel like it coming back so I end up getting them anyway so that which means I'm gonna have to carry this upstairs and so what I'm gonna do is just gonna carry the cold items so I don't have to do two trips in the rain and when I pick up little man from school and I bring up the um the uh, other items and I would definitely be coming back this week to um Look in the women's department clearance section. I will not be bringing a little man with me because he thinks every time he comes to the store, he has to get something and that is not the case. <laughs> but anyway, guys, if you're new, welcome. If you're not new and see most of my videos and you have not yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe for your girl. I really appreciate it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. I do respond. If you can share and thumbs up the video, I really appreciate it. And I hope where you're at, it's dry but this is part of florida we're used to it that's why i'm out now in the rain recording this is it's about to be that season so pretty much during the summertime most people think of florida just being a sunshine state just sunny absolutely not that's why we have a lot of swamps here it rains all the time and so when you're born here you're from here or lived here for multiple years you kind of get used to doing any, everything in the rain because right now it's raining and this afternoon it's supposed to be sunny that's Florida for you. Peace out, guys. Bye.